hey y'all and uh welcome back to my channel um so we are back with the wave rider family and um the twins uh charm and cherish are young adults and ready to go to university they've already put in their applications and applied for their scholarships um but uh just to catch you up a little bit from the last time we visited them um they have moved back to Sulani from um the name of that place again <laughs> Glimmerbrook uh, they've moved back to Solani from you know where they came from and uh, mostly because the grandparents in my head anyway uh, wanted uh, to get back to the island um, and uh, Petunia was able to uh, achieve her goals of becoming a um, spellcaster um, the twins the Petunia and Bucky um, were born in um, Glimmerbrook <laughs> and uh, it turns out Charm was a spellcaster and Cherish was a mermaid which is perfect um, but uh, so you'll learn but Charm is uh, She's more tech savvy. Um, she's going to lean more towards the um, probably robotics career. She has high skill in programming and gaming, um, and just started on robotics just a little bit. Um, and Cherish is uh, definitely more of an artistic uh, child, uh, more young adult now. Uh, so uh, not sure exactly what her um, university degree will end up being in, but. Uh, I have a feeling they'll be going to different universities, um, but they haven't got their acceptance letter yet. So let's get in here and see what happens. Oh, uh, by the way, if you are at all interested in uh, this family's backstory a little bit, um, I'll put a um, card up here that will um, link you back to um, the Realm of Magic. Uh, let's play I did previously and uh, looks like everybody's ready for bed and someone's getting abducted okay well bye Bodie Bodie's the grandfather <laughs> um, at least there's no chance of getting pregnant we have a full household <laughs> and he's an elder um, you know what so in my game um, they just got back from a uh, birthday party where they aged up. Um, I believe they've already applied. Let me just make sure, though. I have cats in real life, and there's a cat on here meowing, so I'm like, trying to figure out which one's real. <laughs> uh, okay, so I should be able to check and see if they've applied right here. Yes, that's Kitty Precious meowing. Okay. University. Okay. Check application status. Child scholarships. Okay, yeah. I think they're good. Um, we'll wait till morning. And uh, go ahead and check those application statuses for both scholarships and uh, for university in general. Um, yeah, let me just check hers too real quick. Yes, and applied. Yeah. Yeah. So I didn't, um, I couldn't apply for any new A scholarships so since the last time they have acquired quite a lot of money. Um, mostly do to these uh, money trees. We got one and then we copy pasta and another. So they're, they're, they're pretty rich right now. Uh, oh, Bodhi's back.
Oh, he got eaten by a cow plant recently, too. He's in pretty bad shape. <laughs> now that's a real cat. Okay, Charm is awake. Do not bother with that cow plant. <laughs> um, let's have her check her university information. Um, check application status. Okay. Oh, there's a plate of food in the way. There we go. Check application status. Okay. Well, ma'am. Oh. Hmm. Anything yet? Uh -huh. Still going through the system. Okay, so if hers isn't ready yet, I'm going to go ahead and say that her sister's is not either. But well, since we're here with her, oh, well, she's automatically going to video games, I told you. We're shit right now on skills. Yeah, she's got sit level six programming and level she's on level seven video gaming, so it makes sense that she will be honestly I'm surprised she wasn't recruited, but I don't think they had to do them recruiting. But she was able to apply for esports. You're hungry. You're like, feed me, and I'm gonna take, take a shower. Okay. But uh, yeah, she's a spellcaster, and she's um, she's learned some stuff. She's she's not nearly as advanced as her mom. All right, we'll come back in just a second. Uh, she's all messed up in the shower and the bathtub. The game kind of messed her up because she's part, she was part mermaid. So she looks weird when she takes baths. <laughs> I have no idea how to fix that. So, oh, this is Wiffle. This is uh, a third generation for this family um, dog. You know what? She needs a bath, or he needs a bath. So won't you do that while you're just standing around? See, Charm's gonna miss her um, little pod bed down here. But she may—I don't know—she may get her another one when she goes to university. Because I don't think they're gonna be living in the dorms anyway. I think they're gonna be buying a separate house somewhere. Oh yeah, um, Charm, or rather Cherish, is, uh, she's erratic, so yeah. Let's go look at their, um, their traits while we're sitting around here, waiting. Um, so there's reward tra traits, sure, but, um, Cherish is creative, erratic, and perfectionist. And Charm is clumsy, a geek, and genius. So being clumsy working on robots and electricity might be a little dangerous. But that's the one. Um, for both of them, I, I chose two of their traits. And then the third one, I let it be, um, let it be random. And that's what they got. Erratic and clumsy for the random traits. Come on, male.
by the way, if you ever have any questions about CC that I might have in my game, feel free to put that in the comments and I will do my best to uh, get that information. What made me think about it is this mailbox. The mailbox is by uh, Renora Sims and uh, you can find her on Tumblr. There's a, uh, I'll, actually I'll try to put a link to it down in the description. I know Solani did not come with a mailbox, so she did a really good job of making one and it's fully functional. Um, works just fine with um, university. As you can see, there's a university option right there. Hanabi. I know Bucky's a little famous. Uh, their father, he's an entertainer, comedian. You know what? Patina you can just magic some uh, some food for everybody. So I think she should do that. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> really? Okay. Just grab a serving. <laughs> Everybody's grabbing stuff and cooking stuff. Uh, look, there's literally food down here too. Elani made chili, or rather Franks and beans. They're really bad about eating food that's just already there. <laughs> I hate to see how they're going to fare in university if I don't, if I don't control them every five seconds. But we will see. Oh, they're not going to be in dorms anyway, so, well, probably not. All depends, and if they can get in their um, distinguished degrees in each, um, in each university of their choice. So yeah, the idea is for Charm to go to Foxbury and Cheris to go to Brightchester for the arts. It is so convenient to have witches in the family. Of course, she did a repairio before near about burnt the house down. So yeah, she's not quite at her mom's... Uh, skill level yet. Oh, there I am. Hey, me. Uh, yeah, I'm also the grandfather of these twins. I'm, I'm, I'm the other, other grandparents. Uh, one half of the other grandparents. Well, thanks, Morgan Ember. <laughs> and that is uh, my sim self, sim husband. <laughs> and the sim self of my husband in real life. <laughs> Inviting him. Well, he's, he's already in, so... <laughs> You know what? Maybe they should each get tans before they go to. Because <laughs> it might be a while before they get a tan again. Let's see. Sunbathe in. Uh... Yeah, I mean, you know, just like their mom, they're fairly okay with their bodies. and They would definitely sunbathe in the nude. Y'all just cross your fingers. I took my mod out. Shows naked people. Yeah. Okay. We're all blurred. That's good. <laughs> yeah, they're both light skin. Neither of them really got their their mom's uh, darker complexion because her dad's so pale. <laughs> Tune you, hun. Why are you out here sleeping on the boat? Anyway. After they get their tans, they're totally checking their university applications again. Because, you know, I'm projecting a little bit and this would be me. <laughs> oh shit.
Okay, she's not burnt. That's good. How are you doing? Oh. Oh, she got real dark. Why do you got that funky? Hold on. Pause. <laughs> Why you got this funky makeup on when you... Okay. Oh, no to be. I'm here to check your application status. Oh, good lord, there's food sitting there. And... Okay, so you know, apparently food blocks people from using computers and drives me nuts. What happened? Are you... Why... Why haven't you cleaned this dog yet? Like, what, what the what? Oh, that's why. <laughs> we got in the bathtub. Oh my god, why are you here? Did you just... Okay. Feed. When you're sick. Good lord, everybody's falling apart. And you're still naked. Ah, uh, woohoo! Cherish got accepted. Where she can she go? Oh, she's got distinguished degrees in a couple places. It looks like, yeah. Um, she's probably gonna get. Oh, <laughs> biology, Billy. Huh. Okay. So she's gonna to wanna to go to Brightchester because she got into all these actually, art, history, culinary arts, drama, and fine art. Um, she's probably gonna to go to fine art. Um, awesome. Boy, schmezzle. <laughs> well, let's check um, scholarships. <laughs> Oh, she got the Future Star Award $200, not Award of Athletics. That's okay. Chilo Panive Baima. Floopy. Okay, now, girl, you get up. And let your sister check her stuff. Oh well, gosh, will you get off the computer? Jesus. <laughs> Kitty Fresh, son. Calm it down. Really? The Gen Z Kimbalaya Zulmona's arrow. Arvini. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Move the plate. Girl, you're going to drive me crazy. I already see it. Spaghetti or whatever it is, or garlic noodles. <laughs> Ready. <laughs> All right, Charm. Yes, Charm also got accepted, which is not a surprise, but she got accepted into a lot of distinguished degrees at uh, Foxbury. She got um, biology, computer science, economics, physics, physiology, or psychology, and villainy. University, scholarships, check scholarship applications.
Wow, she got esports and building the future. Um, so she does. She did get esports. So she is going to be on the esports team. That's awesome. University enroll. I would be glad to get away from. I mean, I love the cowboys, but I would be glad to get away from them. <laughs> Ma'am, get off of the computer. <laughs> oh my god. I went like a really long time actually without this family having a computer because they are just annoying when you're not, when you're trying to do other things. Okay, so we definitely want her to go to Foxbury. And. Yes. Whether you like to think big or think small, the physics degree has got you covered from subatomic particles to the edges of our universe. This degree will help you build the handiness, robotics, and science, rocket science skills along with fascination with fascination for the ways things truly work. Yes, this is it. Um, just to double check though, I want to look at computer science real quick. Computers are everywhere. So learning to manage and program them is a smart move. Join the technical revolution with a computer science degree, which will primarily build the programming and robotic skills. Degree benefits due to the Hawksbury Institute's prestige in this area. This distinguished degree allows for entering a high level with large signing bonus while greatly increasing daily pay, job performance, and vacation on the following queers. Okay. And they say queers, I say the couriers. Sorry. <laughs> um I don't know. Not making it terribly clear. <laughs> I'm going to guess it's this one. It's a physics distinguished degree. Um, hmm. I'm looking with three core and an optional elective. Sure. <laughs> I don't know what that's for, but okay. Um, yeah, we're going to have to go off campus. So off campus, Sims choosing to live off campus will move out of their current house and into another, allowing them to move in with other households or buy a new home. If the Sim intends to purchase a new place, it is prudent to give them enough funds to do so. Note that canceling during move out will place your Sim in the My Household's bin. Okay. I don't even know if there is a place for us to live off campus, but we're going to look there. Um, pay with household funds. We're rich. Oh, yeah, because we... Yeah, we're good. <laughs> and we got scholarships. And a merit scholarship. All right, well, Petunia and her, fa her, uh, her parents uh, did the work, so they don't have to as far as money goes. So let's give them... just in case, because they're going to have to buy a house. Uh, it's not letting me do that, is it? Okay. So, yeah, we totally just kicked the pleasants out of their home. Um, we bought it. It's fine. Um... So we got to go back and get the other sister. <laughs> They're twins. I don't know why I just didn't let them enroll and whatnot at the same time. So let's go back and get um, Miss Cherish. Okay, girl. University. Enroll in university. 
Let's get you moved in with your sister. So she's definitely going to go to University of Brightchester. With a distinguished degree. Probably in fine art. We got floor designer, freelance artist, freelance. That's with a real musician. Silas, she's going to be a musician more than likely. Maybe art though. She got distinguished degrees and all these others, so so very proud of her. Very proud of her, my baby. Art history. I don't think she wants to do art history. Art history and center. No, she definitely wants to go. She definitely wants to go into the fine art degree. And yeah, she'll take three classes and. Um, Piano Sonata Appreciation. Um, we want to go with something that she's just not really interested in. You know what though, she, um, hmm, that's cute. You know what, she's not born into acting, but let's do improvisation and, act, improvisation and acting. Off campus. Uh, she had a little bit of a cost, but we'll pay. Well, no, we'll pay with student, um, household funds because we rich. Um, she's already going to have money when she moves in with her sister. So we're gonna move her in. Right, Justin. Yes. All right, this is gonna be knocking futs, but um, yeah, they each have a four 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 class caseload caseload board. Um, I'm back in my actual job. Okay, um, a four class load plus. Charm is going to be doing esports at Foxbury, so um, got a feeling going to be redoing this lot a bit, but for now, I, mean, I do want them to get roommates. Yeah, I'm going to be redoing all this. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Hold on. Am I missing a bedroom? Oh, there's a third story, dear. Okay. Wow, that's really nice. Yeah, um, we redoing this. Because <laughs> we want roommates. Um, let's check and see what their class schedules are like. Okay, so what, it starts on mon Monday, yeah. Her starts on Monday. Wait. Three days. No. Wednesday there. Two days. So Tuesday. If it ain't Baroque. <laughs> oh, you know, we're going to have to buy some violins. I didn't think about bringing it with us. So class in two days. Is she already doing her homework? Good lord, okay. I'm not I'm not mad at it. Two days. Two days. Practice squad member, okay. Okay, we're gonna need a
Oh, well, activity starts in 20 hours. Oh, she's already got skill. Play Sim Scuffle. Is there a computer up in this place? <laughs> uh. Near. This place sure was expensive, not to have much in it. Well, we're going to go ahead and leave this right here. They have uh, enrolled in a uh, university, and they have classes soon. Um, but yeah, I'm going to end it here so I can go in and redo this house and maybe give them a little bit of an updated makeover. And uh, we'll get into preparing for classes and going to our first classes in a couple of days. Um, all right, well, thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you're interested in seeing the rest of the series, please uh, give it a subscribe um, and a like. Um, and uh, comment below with any suggestions what you might like to see. Um, I'm really excited to see what these girls get up to in college. Uh, this is not a dorm experience, so um, if you'd like to see a dorm experience, I've got another Let's Play going um, where I challenge them. And, um, I'll put a link to it over here somewhere. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.